Brilliant. I'll finally get rid of this nasty taste. Oh. <laughs> okay. New mission. I hope Goal is watching this. This is something that I'll only do once. What was that? Did you hear that too? Sounded pretty miserable. Yes, did. Well, I don't think we need to be frightened of an animal that makes sounds like that. It's probably physically challenged. <laughs> Crap. As long as the top is down, I can't make out anything in here. I'll save my telekinetic powers for... Ow! I'll save my... T I'll save my... <laughs> the bone-shattering honking will knock them out cold. Uh, which brings us to plan B. Ow! I'll save my telekin. Ow! What was that? Meow. No, that was not a cat. That was something big. Meow. A cow! A cow must be entangled in this pile of junk. So it would seem. Ch stupid animal. Good thing I'm always thinking on my feet. What was that? No, forget it. There's nothing there. Easy now. Finally, I can get over there without it squeaking. I can't get any closer. The Organons would see me. I'll save my telekinetic... I don't need light for my inventory. I sort everything according to an... In hey, where's my bucket? Maybe this could sweeten my... Ta but more... Only two of them? Why, that's almost an insult. I'll save my tele... I can't get any closer. The organ on... Finally, I can get over... Or, I'll just take it along. Now I hear it, too. Hello? Hello, who's there? You're paranoid, 2017. <laughs> huh. 
That wasn't half bad. Hey, half bad is my second name, babe. Stop calling me that. Now, come on. We need to hurry. Stop! Who goes there? It's me, Cletus, accompanied by my charming fiance, Gold. Finally. I was afraid she'd already eloped with that disgusting deponium. What a bizarre thought. Oh, contraire, Buttercup. Don't be afraid to admit that you did cast a covetous eye on that <laughs> Rufus. Very understandable. To me, he seemed like a dashing daredevil. On the contrary, Honey Bunny. He was nothing more than a self-centered fool. That's enough. You two will have enough time to frolic once we've returned to Elysium. Oh, yeah, final, final, um, fi final, fi final preparations for our return have been made. Very well. Now, I need to talk to you in private, Ambassador. Uh, uh of, of course. <clears throat> Why don't you scuttle on ahead, darling? Me and the bailiff have urgent matters to discuss. <laughs> Seemingly. B but Shoo shoo, sugar. <laughs> if you insist, <laughs> so we'll see each other in a short while, then. Toodaloo. Have you lost your mind completely? I thought we had an agreement. The memories of Ms. Gold must be deleted. And we need the Ascension Codes. Don't panic. I'm working on it. I'll swap the cartridges and uh, leave the original on the platform. That, that, that should make everyone happy, right? Yes, everyone except for the Deponians. <laughs> if you try anything funny, I'll personally decapitate you with a rusty knife. <laughs> Yikes. People are living here, Cletus. I've seen them with my own eyes. I already told you. Ulysses is right. We can't... Am I interrupting? Rufus, finally. I was about to throw this ignorant idiot from the tower. Don't ask me why I fancied him in the first place. What are you doing, Rufus? I thought we had an agreement. Think again, Cletus. I'll go to Elysium with Gaul. <laughs> this is a joke, right? Please, go. tell me that this is a joke. It's not a joke. Rufus will come to Elysium with me. He'll help me to tell everyone the truth about Deponia. Ha <laughs> ha! And you really believe they'll grant someone like him access to Elysium? Why not? Everyone will think it's you. Him? Don't make me laugh. Give it up, Cletus. What's this? You're unleashing your lice upon me. Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. Besides, that doesn't sound even remotely like me. I think he does quite a good impression of you. Huh. Be that as it may, this one-man free circus will never pass for me. Look at the way he dresses. Disgusting. Do I have to get angry first? Are you threatening me? Listen, bub. I've got the third ASCAT in the art of Shwekhulu. Yeah, just like I do. Oh, yeah? What's your dojo? Uh, five? Five? I mean, uh, yellow. The fire? Capricorn? Ocelot? Damn. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. I already told you that you shouldn't eat me. Besides, that doesn't sound even remotely like me. I think he does quite a good impression of you. Huh. Be that as it may, this one-man free circus will look at the way he dresses. Disgust. You two go ahead and sort it out between you. But, Rufus... 
And you're planning to elope to Elysium with a wimp like that? Don't make me laugh. Rufus is twice the man you are, hands down. Maybe his feet are twice the size. What have we here? A second disguise. Let's see who's the better Cletus. No, I... <laughs> the Rufus is twice in these the man you are, hands down. Maybe his feet are twice the size. You can't even size. fit a bucket and mop in there, let alone a parrot. And At least fat. Rufus knows how to treat a woman well. Yeah, well... Oh, you mean right after he's bludgeoned her with a club? Almost as good as my handmade disguise. <laughs> the inventory in these rags is ridiculously small. You can't even fit a bucket and mop in there, let alone a parrot and two cats. I'll put my stuff here for now. Rufus is twice the man you are, hands down. Maybe his feet are twice the size. Whoa. All right, that's enough. <laughs> so this is the wimp you want to replace me with. Don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. I already told you that you shouldn't ape me. Besides, that doesn't sound even remotely like me. I think he does quite a good impression of you. <laughs> Be that as it may, this one-man flea circus will never pass for me. He can try and put on my clothes all he wants and infest them with bugs. There is still one thing where I'm completely different. Oh, my. Your sagging butt cheeks? <laughs> my birthmark, you dumbass. Whoa. What are you doing? Ouch! No, don't! Ha! <laughs> yeah! We did it! We really did it! Towards Elysium! Not so fast, buddy. What was the agreement that Cletus was talking about? What? Oh, that. Forget it. That's all toxic waste under the bridge. Let's go. To Elysium! Wait a minute. That's it, right? You don't even care about what happens to Deponia. You just want to get to Elysium, whatever the cost. Me? No. What a change of attitude. He sounded quite different earlier. Deponia stinks. Only idiots live here. If it were up to me, they could blow the whole place sky high. Yada, yada, yada. You keep out of this. Don't believe a word he's saying, Gold. He just wants to drive us apart. But how do I know I can trust you? Trust this rat. Don't make me laugh. Go. he hates Deponia. He's an egomaniac, a thief, and a traitor. Just go through his things. I'm pretty sure you'll find a backup cartridge, just in case you realize what he's up to. He wouldn't do that. Well, go ahead. Have a look. Gold. don't. Gold. Listen, you don't understand. I think I understand very well. You know, Rufus, I really thought you were something special. But I am something special. I know you think that, but you're nothing but an egotistical scoundrel. You don't only resemble Cletus on the outside. Come over here. I want to take a good look at you before I return to Elysium alone, so I can remember what kind of a face not to fall for yet a third time. I'm... I'm sorry. <laughs> Bother! What next? Argus! About time, too! Get me down from here! Why should I? From the start, you've been jeopardizing our plans, Cletus. Rufus, on the other hand... You can't be serious! You're not saying you trust this lying rat more than me! Why not? He is indeed a lying rat. Hey! But that's what makes him the perfect man for the job. 
He'll be celebrated as a hero in Elysium, and he'll get the girl. He'll get everything he ever dreamed of. Do you really think he'd risk all that just to save his home that he loathes so much? He's not man enough to do that. Once Gold sees his true self, he'll lose everything he tried to achieve. He'll never take that risk. Congratulations, Rufus. You did it. Just insert the backup cartridge and you can leave. Elysium awaits you. for a while no no don't worry i know that you need to go easy on your back and once we're back on elysium i'll give you a nice back rub okay i guess so come on don't make such a gloomy face in a way it's a good thing that our inspection was without results although i can't remember everything or was there something else um. come on how about a bit more enthusiasm towards elysium and all that. Yes? No? Um... What's wrong? Is there something you'd like to tell me? Aren't you happy to be going back to Elysium? I am. It's just that... Well then, towards Elysium, right? It's a goal. Yes? Um... It's like this. I'm all ears. Well... What are you stammering about? Spit it out. It's just that... You're beginning to scare me. What's wrong with you? All right then. I'm gonna tell you now. But you have to promise not to get mad. Why, Cletus? Why would I get mad at you? Calm down. Relax. Relax. Some con man erases my memory, poses as my fiance, and almost gets me involved in a genocide, and I'm supposed to relax. I, I told you about it, didn't I? I mean, I'm the, I'm the good guy. You'll be the dead guy if you don't return my old memories. But that'd be suicide. Believe me, buddy, not doing it would be suicide. Okay, okay. And now remove this fragment of pseudo-personality from my brain. And don't even think about inserting it again. Yeah, yeah, I'm working on it. Ungrateful... Ooh. Fortunately, the goal on the other cartridge likes me a bit more. Ugh! Lace underwear for men! <laughs> he can keep those. What? Where? I... Rufus, you miserable! Um, no. That's what the catch was. For once, you tell the truth, and what do you get? Stop ogling like that! Stop ogling like that! Stop og- And what are you gonna do about it? I mean it! God have mercy on you if you- Ron, God have mercy on you if you- Let me finish, you boob! And may God have mercy on you if you- No, on you! <laughs> They'll greet me with a ticker tape parade in Elysium and confetti. Oh boy, I love conf- This guy's luggage. I bet he forgot the bolt cutter. Of course not. You never know when you have to cut through a wire fence. No. Ugh! Lace underwear. <laughs> he could. What? Where? I. Rufus? 
You miserable? Um, no. That's what the catch was. This has to go faster. We need those codes. Yes, Bernif. You do know what's at stake. If Ulysses had had his way, we'd all perish here on Deponia. Yes, Bailiff. Any problems here? No, Prime Controller, sir. Just a relay that short-circuited. This matter is of no concern now. I want to address the crew before we head on to Portofisco. Immediately. As you wish, Prime Controller. You heard the man. Get moving! Now or never. No time. They could be back any second. Hello. Surprised, are we? I bet you thought you finally made it, huh? Lady Luck loves the righteous, so on and so forth, right? Well, think again, buddy. It's almost ironic. For once in your life, you decide to do the right thing, and immediately you lose everything. <laughs> your dream turns into a nightmare. The love of your life is lost, and your home planet gone. <laughs> I would really love to pity you now, but the cable boat is ready, and the ascension codes have been entered. I don't want to let Elysium wait for me any longer. After all, they're expecting a report from me. I could have left already, by the way, but how shall I put it? My back is troubling me. I don't want to do all the rowing by myself. So, hand over the cartridge. Now! Gold's memories about your failed attempt to mess with my plans should still be stored in her short-term memory. I can delete that in a minute. Hand it to me. Ha, you wish. What is going ah, on here? The Organon. Always on time, always reliable. I guess I owe you an apology. That rat didn't swallow your cheese, Bailiff, but... I'm not an unforgiving person. Once Rufus hands over the cartridge, we'll be able to carry out our scheme as planned. Now more than ever. You heard him, Rufus. Give him the cartridge now. Come on, Rufus. Be reasonable. I will return to Elysium no matter what. You can't change that. But if you hand over the data, you'll at least have a chance at saving goal. So what do you say? Do we have an agreement? Never. Well, I guess I'll have to row myself, then. Too bad. But I should have known that your pride is more important to you than Gull's life. <laughs> I bet you already figured out a nice lie to tell her when she wakes up, and then realizes that you've brought her a front row seat for Armageddon. Ah, uh, wait a minute. No, no, don't waste my time. Give me the cartridge or don't. <laughs> How unusually reasonable of you. <laughs> and I bet that Goal would be thankful too. Unfortunately, she will never know that you even existed. My, my, my. Deponia will make such a great display of fireworks for our wedding. <laughs> Um, a lot. Uh, uh, can't you remember anything at all? Of course I can remember. I... I... Um... We two were on board an Organon cruiser. We wanted to inspect Deponia, right? We're on Deponia now. Our mission is over. Did I fall asleep? There, there was an accident. You fell from the cruiser. That's why you can't remember anything. But take a look around. Deponia really is deserted. Oh 
Unbelievable. Nothing but junk. Yes, just junk. Nothing else. Come, let's go home to Elysium. We have to prepare our wedding. Yes, let's go. That, I guess. I'll be on my way too. The way home to Kuvak is long, and I need to prepare for the apocalypse. Not so fast, Sonny. You didn't think we'd let you leave just like that. You know too much. Also, I believe you have something that belongs to us. Oh, yes. The cartridge. Hmm. Give it to me. What is it? What are you waiting for? Oops. No! <laughs> so long, suckers! What? No! Get that traitor! Shoot him! Well, my friend, did you lose something? The cartridge? Uh, bravo, Prime Controller, sir! Damn, he's too far away. Give up, little man. See you later. No, stop! Oh, oh. What are you doing? Stop, stop, stop. Ah, you damn fool, let go! Back so soon? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a pretty impressive fall. And you managed to land in the pile of needles. Never seen anything like it. You have my respect. <laughs> Everything all right, kid? You seem a bit stressed out. Course is set. Next stop, the floating black market. Good, great, fine. Are you all right, Rufus? You sound all tuckered out. You didn't finish telling me what happened up there on the tower. I don't want to be nosy, but uh, is Deponia safe? That's out of my hands now. Now look at you, startled. The brain implant cartridge has not been swapped, which was all part of the plan. A world has been rescued that he did detest. Who'd have guessed? I attest, you'd have done just the same. So if you still want to force me to do stupid chores, like washing the dishes to the trash and such, you'll just prove that you haven't paid attention to what I said. The message and scores like, Huzzah, as a rule. Huzzah, the 